Hi, my beautiful and lovely Capricorns. It's Baby Boss Tarot. Okay, I have brought back the Romance, Rebel and Fortune reading. I guys, remember on July 28th, it's my one year anniversary. So if you want a full day dedicated to your sign, every video I do between now and then, um, of your sign, view it to your heart's content, keep the views going, like the videos, get the likes up, subscribe to the channel. Okay. And then you will get a whole day dedicated to your sign. Right. Mm, confirmation there. My nose is itchy. What's going on for you? Somebody's hay fever could be really playing up. Because I've, I've literally just done um, all the signs so far. You're the first one that my nose is itchy for. So um, there is some sort of truth and clarity possibly coming up. Or somebody's lying their ass off to you. Oh, just as I said that, deception fell out. There you go, someone's lying their ass off to you. Okay, someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. Okay, so you've got someone who's lying to you. You've got flirt. Extend your light-hearted energy to others. And now they're saying go blind on this one. Okay, pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. Okay. So, uh, trouble, could walk, trouble could walk back into your life. Oh, I just caught that scene from, uh, what do you call it, Sweet Alabama. Sweet Home Alabama. Yeah, when Jake Perry's mum, the bar owner, says, Trouble done walk back into my life disguised, disguised as my favourite daughter-in-law. <laughs> this could be that sort of thing. This could be an in-law. <laughs> he was a bit of a troublemaker, but pay attention, Capricorn. Someone's about to walk back into your life, uh, and they're full of shit, basically. You may, you may be flirting with them, or, you know, they... Uh, may want to flirt with you, but seriously pay attention to the red flags of this person. I want to get a bit more clarity on this. You're the first sign I'm doing this for. I need more clarity as to what is going on. Alright, let's get the cinema tarot deck. Okay, what is deception for Capricorn? What is the deception for Capricorn? There it is. Alright, let's see. Eight of Cups and the Wheel. Okay, somebody could tell you that they are, uh, that um, they've walked away from somebody. They could have walked away from a fire sign or a cancer Pisces Scorpio, but that doesn't look like the case here, okay? Um, they could tell you that they've walked straight into one hell of a fortune, that they're lucky. What is this? The Tower and the Devil. Yeah, somebody's lying their ass off to you, for sure. Okay, this is this is the pay attention to the red flag sort of thing, okay. Um, the tower and the devil. Be mindful with this person, they could have an STD if you sleep with them, okay. Um, I'm getting, I'm feeling very sexual energy off of this person, could be why they're, they're going to flirt with you. But they could tell you that they have walked away from somebody. Or they've broken up with somebody, but they haven't. That relationship is actually quite strong. But if they get with you, this tower is going to fall right down. Alright, because they're tempted away. This could be you as well, though. Alright, Capricorn, you could get tempted away. I mean, your own card is out here. The devil, that's your card. And you've got Mars Energy there, Scorpio Aries. But somebody's foundation is about to come crashing down. Somebody may walk away to find their fortune you know, walk away and get good karma, but whatever this is, this is all clarifying deception, okay, somebody could have a lot of addictions or obsessions, <clears throat> yeah, this person is not telling you the whole truth, I'm hearing they're addicted to sex and drugs, but they're not letting on, anyway, that took far too long, but I needed clarity on that deception, and I think you needed it as well, so someone's going to lie to you about about certain things, about addictions. I probably tell you, told you that they're broken up with someone. Yeah, 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 I've walked away from someone. It's complete cod's wallop. Twaddle. <laughs> I don't know where twaddle came from. Alright. I don't even know where cod's wallop came from. Showing my fucking name there, and I? Right. What does the rebel want to say to Capricorn? Oh, all clarity. Right. Don't believe every shitty thought you have okay those 
that thoughts can be sneaking lying bastards. Alright, you got ah, you're a rebel, Capricorn. Rebel, because fuck it. Alright, what is your fortune? What is your fortune for Capricorn? Okay, you have luck. So a sudden change of luck is likely. Uh, things are working in your favour. Excellent time for networking. We saw the Wheel of Fortune come out, and that was right next to the Eight of Cups, which is walking away from a deception to get this luck. All right? So it could be Capricorn, but you realise that someone was being deceptive to you from the outset. You walked away from them because they had addictions, because you broke their fucking tower. Yeah? Luck is coming your way. You've got care required. Ground yourself against deception and be careful of making foolish mistakes at this time. Don't give in to that devil. The devil energy. Don't give in to it. Okay, because you may regret it. Got burnout. <clears throat> Sorry. Okay, either my allergies are playing up or somebody else's is. But you've got your hard work. We'll see results, but your health needs to be maintained. So check in with your doctor, dentist, and health professional and try to maintain a healthy lifestyle. So future, you may travel or host an overseas traveller soon. Either way, great, great social fun awaits. I knew you said sexual, so it <laughs> could be sex, sexual fun awaits you. You've got nature. Interact with nature in the outdoors, around animals, farmlands, or by the ocean. This will be good for the soul and healing for you. Alright, who could you be dealing with? Firstly, I want to find out who's going to be the deceptive person. Got Jupiter. So, a Sagittarius or um, a Virgo could be a deceptive one. Right, who are you dealing with this weekend? Uh, Capricorn. Who are you dealing with this weekend, Capricorn? Okay, you could be dealing with a Cancer. Water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. And you've got Saturn, so another Capricorn like yourself. Or an Aquarius. They tell me to point out this one. I don't know why, but they're saying, look at this one. So, Cancer may be significant to you this weekend. Okay, right, Capricorn, that was your read, guys. 